Payment fraud detection cannot wait. We need to determine in near real time if the payment is valid or fraudulent. And the challenge just gets bigger with a spike in demand. Companies report year after year billions of dollars of loss due to identity theft because of the inability of systems to react quickly enough to identity theft tactics or process the volume, variety, and velocity of digital identity and transaction data in near real time. The simple truth is that an effective fraud detection solution cannot live in legacy data architecture where these problems fester. In this demo, we will cover two solutions that can help us build a super fast and efficient fraud detection solution. First, we'll cover digital identity validation, which helps companies process dynamic and complex identity data coming from multiple data sources in various data types to validate a user's actions or access. Then we'll finish with transaction risk scoring, where Redis enables fast serving of features for deploying machine learning risk scoring models in real time. Both of these solutions benefit from Redis Enterprise's multi-model support and innate ability to process hundreds of millions of operations a second with less than one millisecond of latency. We'll go over these solutions and talk about their architecture, why and when we use them, and then finish with a demo example of each. So that's quite a lot to cover and we're going to do it in less than five minutes. So let's dive in. Starting with digital identity validation and why it needs to be in real time. Unlike traditional knowledge-based authentication using static information, digital identity uses multiple and frequently updated elements, including behavioral, geolocation, social, and mobile device profiles. Architectures based on disk-based legacy databases don't meet the requirements for high write throughput and low latency for updating and querying dynamic digital identity data. RDBMS follow a strict tabular schema, while other NoSQL databases are typically limited to a single model, like JSON, and can't handle multiple unstructured data types. Redis Enterprise not only has that speed and throughput, but supports multiple data types and models to enable real-time identity validation. So when do we use this solution? When a high volume and dynamic identity data must be queryable in sub-millisecond latency to either validate or deny access to a user. With that, let's turn to the demo. In this demo, one of the first things you can do by reducing fraud on an e-commerce site like this is to validate the user as part of the login process. When users create their accounts and profiles, we get a lot of user data that can help identify them, like a location from an IP address, browser footprint, device metadata, and more. After purchasing, we start to build a user profile for them for what types of purchases they buy, which we'll tie in later with the risk score. All of these different identity elements get stored in Redis and can vary widely in regard to data type. If for some reason, one of these digital identities data jerked far from their original footprint, say a different IP address in a different country, the site could request an SMS code or security question. Ultimately, Redis Enterprise is a great solution for digital identity validation by providing a fast and scalable data store that can be used to store and serve identity data to identity validation services to authenticate a user. Now on to our last solution, transaction risk scoring. Similar to validating identities, we are now verifying transactions based on machine learning risk scoring models to determine whether the transaction is fraudulent or not. You've probably received a text or notification from your bank or credit card company when they've detected a plausible fraudulent transaction. Whether or not that happened fast enough, you'll have to tell me. If you try to buy something and you get that message or alert in real time, chances are your bank is using Redis. The big challenge for banks and other financial businesses with transaction risk scoring is both the latency, how fast the features used in the model get served, and handling the peak throughput from an increasing amount of digital channels and spikes on days like Black Friday, and eventually not being able to meet the transaction SLAs. Approving or denying that transaction must not cause friction or delay, else it degrades the customer experience. So when do we use it? When artificial intelligence and machine learning, AI, ML, risk scoring models require diverse and large volumes of real-time features that must be available to determine a fraudulent transaction. With that, let's jump into the demo. In this demo, we'll return to our e-commerce website 
and we'll take a look at three different user personas, men's formal, sports, and ladies formal. These profiles are what would be considered features used in predictive risk scoring models and are stored on Redis Enterprise. There is an associated risk score with items these typical personas purchase. For example, in sports, the risk score number for that persona to purchase a water bottle is very low and shouldn't trigger any sort of action. It's pretty unsophisticated for a risk scoring model, but it's a simple example. But let's jump to the website and see what happens if we pick items not usually associated with a typical persona. First, I'll set my persona to sports. And then let's purchase something that this persona typically wouldn't buy, perhaps like a tie. We'll go ahead and add this to our cart. And look, we've got a notification saying it's possible fraud, but it's been added to the cart. We can hover over the possible fraud button and it shows our fraud score. And um, what's interesting is that now that we have, or if we would go and put other sports related items in with the cart, then our overall risk score would go down because um, our model could determine that this persona is buying what they usually buy with the exception of one item, but that's okay. But if I kept adding unrelated items, then our risk score would continue to get worse. Ultimately, Redis Enterprise is a great solution for transaction risk scoring by acting as the online feature store, providing real-time data to machine learning risk scoring models. Well, that covers it. Redis Enterprise is an ideal data platform for enabling real-time fraud detection. Fraud detection cannot wait, and real-time detection is the only viable solution. Want to get started? Download our solution brief below to go into even more detail on these solutions.